boys and girls, ladies and gents, and welcome to another one of Big Red Snack Attacks. It's your boy Big Red, and I'd like to welcome you. What do we have on deck? Whenever you see a cup sitting in front of me, you know cookies aren't far behind. So I did my um, Oreo How Would You Dunk contest video two months ago, whatever, and I just never did really uh, individually review any of the 10 flavors of Oreos I had. So I got boxes of Oreos laying around. And it's still springtime, so let's get into the Oreo Spring Edition uh, cookie here. I've only had one or two of these when I did the dunk thing. But let's see if there's anything special on here other than the fact that it says yellow cream same taste one fun spring design so basically it's a regular oreo with yellow dye in the cream nothing special let's try it out Tastes like you. Let's see if you can see the yellow cream. It's not even that yellow. I should mean it's like a pastel yellow. It's your plain old typical Oreo with food coloring in the, in the cream. Neat packaging, neat gimmick. But I don't see the point in it. And other than the fact that you're trying to get people, oh, it's springtime, let me get spring Oreos. I'm not a big Oreo fan. I'm just stuck with all these Oreos because I did that. Oreo dunk challenge thing, which I never heard back from him, so I'm assuming I didn't win. Oh well, it was a try. Give Big Red an E for effort. And the reason I'm not a big Oreo fan is. Not much of a chocolate fan, that's why. Well, you like one or two more of these and let my son wipe the rest of these out. I'm going to do cookies. I'd rather just chocolate chip cookies or homemade snickerdoodles. And I do like uh, pecan sandies. Other than that, I'm not much of a cookie guy. Love me some milk, though. Cookies are just an excuse to have milk. Alright, so I'm pretty much done. I'll be a short video because I don't like Oreos very much. They do have a nice little... Let me see if they're true to their packaging. Let me do one more. My reading glasses on. I can't even read this cookie at night. Them read at night. It says shine on and it's a it's a sun. And the other side just says Oreos with a bunch of flowers around it. Let's see if they got a different one. Because on the on the, the packaging they show 
a B carved into the cookie. So let's see if the, I never noticed that. So it's a typical flavor Oreo. No. No, well, here's a different one. Oh, wow. So they all have different well, things. Like, here's a dude with some whacked out sunglasses. Let me see. Can see he's got a mustache, sunglasses, a nose. So, they did put a little more effort into making these cookies than I thought, but they taste like regular Oreos. One side says Oreos with little flowers on it. And it appears that the reverse side or flip side has other little summertime things like a guy with sunglasses. One said shine on with the sun. You look at the packaging. They got a little bumblebee on it. Little springtime type things. Alright, so let's get to the rating of this. I'm going to give y'all three flip flops. No, I'm going to give you 3.5 flip flops for this. And you get that 0.5 for that extra little, hey, we're going to design the cookie a little different, but I mean, we're not going to make it taste any different. So, make it look a little different, you know, put food coloring in, uh, in the cream filling and we'll just make the flip side of all the cookies look slightly different with a springtime, summertime theme. So, anyway, here or here, I can't remember where, maybe I should watch one of my own videos one time to figure this out or watch other people's videos and I'll figure out what the hell it is, but... You know the drill. Somewhere here or here, there is a subscription button. I see you. You think you need to be pet? I'm trying to talk to the peeps. Okay, so I'll keep one hand down here petting her to keep her happy. Um, so, one of these two corners has a subscription button. If you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Um... Next to that is a subscription bell, which will notify you when I have new content, because sometimes subscribing isn't enough to know when the new content of your uh, people that you subscribe to put out new stuff. Um, and the corner opposite of that, thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me see if I can, I'll pedal with this one. Hit me with one. Don't matter if it's this one or this one. Just let me know that you're watching. We like these better. Hey, look at that. I got cream and cookie. Hmm. Got that. Um, so, hit me with a thumbs up. Just let me know you're watching. Thumbs down. It doesn't matter which. In the middle, there's a description box. Open it up. There's links in there to follow me on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram and Twitter. There's the link to this channel's homepage where you can find all my older videos separated by series. And I've got a bunch of series. So I made it easier for you to find your favorite series and favorite video. Um, so with that being said, life's hard enough. Watching this fat jackass on YouTube shouldn't make life any harder. That's why I do that for y'all. And below that comment section, type me a comment. I'll type you one, show me yours, and I'll show you mine. And as always, tell your ma, tell your pa, tell your crazy, crazy grandma. Show your, tell your family and friends about Big Red. Show them how you get down with Big Red. Maybe they'd want to get down with Big Red too. We can all just rock on down to Electric Avenue together in this big old crazy thing that we call the Big Red Show. So, till next time, I love each and every one of you, and I'll see you next time at the vending machine. This is Big Red for another Big Red Snack Attack. 
I gotta finish this milk and I'm out.